With the new update in Power World, a whole bunch of new base activities have been added, some of which are super OP. Alright, what's good guys? So we are on the new island in the Power World update over here. I decided to build a new base right over here. Now, I was not aware that there's actually glass in the game right now. This looks super, super cool. It's over here in the foundation list. I was not aware that there was glass buildings. You have to unlock them, but uh, I built a cool little tower over here before I even knew that. So I'll probably replace this over here, this little castle with glass soon enough, make more modern buildings. But this is the new base. I have pretty much everything set out. I have almost the max amount of buildings and everything, like all the new stuff, all the new items and everything down. You can see this is the new oil, oil miner right here, which gets you crude oil. But the problem is, guys, the problem is with all these new items, electricity is a humongous issue. It seems like they're really focusing on electricity right now. They don't really care about like mining or anything else that used to be like farming that used to be a problem everything like mining and farming is super easy now and electricity is the big problem so if you guys are building a new base in power world you're definitely going to need a ton of electricity i didn't know that they added these new power banks right here these new generators so i had just a bunch of the small ones all around because those used to be more than enough in the old update right here these small power generators but now in the new update it is nowhere near enough so i'm going to show you guys the best way to get them the best way to use them and the best way to have enough electricity with them so i only had like a few of these small generators like i said and it was not enough to power even these little assembly lines or anything so it definitely wasn't enough to power all of these like furnaces all of these lights on the ceiling definitely not the new oil miners and everything but we took a few steps to help that so i'm gonna go over what we can do with that but for just a few seconds here we're going to go through the new island over here the new base and see what we have so first of all i added the glitched farms like again obviously you're not supposed to stack these farms but i've made a bunch of videos before where i show you guys how to do it so we still added those we have about 10 farms right here in just such a little area which is really really great then we have the pal area over here which is pretty easy i don't know why my pals are stressing so much i think it's because i have them working 24 7. and then we have the new tier 2 or minor right here which is really really cool i highly suggest you guys get it if you throw a few anubisism right there that will get you like I, I'm pretty sure it's over like 3,000 metal ore per hour, probably even more than that if you have Anubises working it, because I've been getting pretty much unlimited ore. This is one of the new items too, the uh, PAL skin changer right there, which is pretty cool. I'm not sure how you get PAL skins. I think you buy them from like the dog coin market or something. I haven't really checked that out. But where most of the action happens is, of course, the electricity room. This is like what they wanted to make really important in the new update. That's why they added crude oil and everything. And of course, crude oil, if you go all the way down here, it gets you plasteel, which can get you some really cool stuff like laser rifles, the new armor and everything, grenade launchers, and all the way down here, like guarded missile launchers and the ultra shield. I haven't got past level 51 yet, so obviously I haven't checked any of that stuff out yet, but a lot of it is really cool and you need crude oil for it. So I have two generators right here the problem with these generators guys is it takes a lot of pal metal ingots and it also takes 200 of the little electrical where is it right here the electrical organs so you guys can see it takes 200 pal metal ingots and 200 organs now obviously those are super hard to get now we're going to go over how to get a lot of them and the best versions of them first of all for the electric organs, this one is pretty simple. You can just use the blacksmith glitch to get a ton of gold. I have about 500,000 gold here and I just ended up buying 200 organs with the electric things and they're super easy to buy. They're like $500 each or something. So if you just do a few gold glitches, you can easily get that. Now, if you don't want to do glitches, it's going to take a lot longer. You don't have to do them obviously, but for the people out there who like glitches, that's a, a really easy way to get all the electrical organs. Now. How you get, pl not plus steel, sorry, the pal metal ingots. That is going to be definitely a little bit harder, but if you set up this um, little tier two mining station, you should be able to get super duper fast. I've had it up for like an hour and I've already got over a thousand pal metal ingots to build whatever I want. But if you don't have those unlocked yet, I'm sure you probably have some saved up from the old update or you have some uh, regular ingots and everything from the old updates that you've been saving up. So now would be a good time to use them. However, 
I am barely holding on with even two of these generators. You can see they're just barely holding on. They're always on like 2% or 0% right now. And that's because I have lights. I have infrastructure over here, like these little assembly lines. I have two furnaces. I have a automatic cooker thing. I have two of the huge oil stations. Now that is obviously not going to cut it. I need some better pals because most of these pals don't even have four electric and that is really, really bad. However, guys, if you want the best pal for doing this right here, this one was actually one of the tower bosses I caught back in the day, the Axel and Orsic. What is that? Orsic? Is that how you say his name? or cirque there we go if you guys want or cirques we're going to head over there right now i'm going to show you the best ways to get them now you should have a good amount of like ultra spears or hyper spears or anything at this point because the meteors give you a whole lot of them if you haven't found the meteor yet if you just go afk for a little bit they should show up but because all my pals aren't for electric you can see right here this one's three this one's two this one's two that's obviously not going to cut it or not even three electric much less four we're definitely going to have to go catch some more or cirques now this part is definitely the most annoying part of the entire process because you have to be a pretty high level to get over here and even when you do get over here they barely spawn but you're going to want to go to the top right of the map and go to the wet or pal sanctuary number three that is where they spawn the or six and they give you a whole bunch of electricity and even with all of that electric stuff i have at my base if i catch one or two more of those they should completely be able to handle that 24 7 and with no stops no interruptions i can mine all the oil i want i can mine or cook all the ores i want i can pretty much do whatever i want if i can get one or two more of these pals so we're just going to fly around here and try and look for them it's kind of annoying because they have like a chance of spawning a chance of not spawning i think they're one of the more rare pals so you're definitely going to have to look around for a little bit it is definitely the most annoying part of this process if you guys can't find any like i can right now you can also just sit around and kill these guys if you're a high level there used to be no point in doing that but now that there's 55 levels and i severely doubt you guys are level 55 already you can just sit here and kill them and new pals will respawn hopefully in ursic and on top of that you get a bunch of cool items and a ton of xp to help you grab up to level 55 so overall it's definitely worth it to sit here and kill them even if you uh want to hurry up and find the ore cirques like i do and you get some really cool stuff like ingots and bones and stuff which aren't the most useful thing but they'll definitely come in handy when you're uh, a little bit low on them and there is a bunch of stuff to build and everything this new update the point of the video is just to show you guys all the new things you can build show you guys how to get the best electric things at the moment and i was a little bit confused because i didn't know how to use the new generators and everything but with these high tier pals and the new crude oil and everything you're definitely going to need to make a few adjustments to your base because they are putting a huge emphasis on electricity this update and in my opinion i kind of really like it but you guys have got to let me know your thoughts in the comments about them putting such a big deal on electricity and if you guys have the means to deal with that in my opinion that adds something new to the game gives you something to grind for so i really like it but you guys if you want can join the discord in the description send some pictures of your base send some pictures of what you guys are doing usually we have a lot of people in the discord asking questions or sending pictures of their base and everything so you guys can do that if you would like i'm still looking for this pal it's been forever there's a little ravine over there which is really good for farming but like i said they made farming and they made uh mining a lot easier this update if you're a high level and then they replaced it with electricity which is a lot harder which in my opinion i think was a really good move they definitely added a whole lot of new things to do with electricity oh wow okay we finally found one now this one's only level 41 so let's be kind of careful not to kill it oh my goodness jet we're gone don't scare me like that let's be kind of careful not to kill it do we have the ring of mercy on us i don't think we have it on us which is a shame because i normally always have it on us where is it Oh, I do have it on me. Perfect. So we'll, the Ring of Mercy is super, super useful, guys. If you guys don't have it, I highly suggest buying it. And we can get him down to 1 HP. No, no, chill, PDF guard. Bro, if the guard kills us, then I, or if the guard kills this pal, I'm going to be very upset. PDIF, infantry, more like pedophile infant okay chill 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 let's get this or circ and hurry up and get him in the ball bro they are impossible to catch even though they're at one hp and i'm a much higher level than him and if this guard kills him i'm gonna be super upset yes 
finally we got him so we get some electric organs from that and we get the pal which is going to make a ton of progress at our base with the electric things and on top of that we get a ton of xp so it is really worth coming over here to try and get these electric pals for the base let's head over to base let's do a quick sugi real quick and uh see if we can improve the electricity output all right so i think think we're going to replace this little giraffe he's a bum he's always complaining about something so we're going to replace him with the newly caught orserk and of course i bet he's a little bit upset because we just absolutely destroyed him he's on one hp but let's feed him some berries and everything and i'm sure he will be good now let's see if we can do the outputs of both of these oil miners and see if it is good enough let's take a peek okay cool it seems like it is going up a lot on both of these even at only 50 percent sanity right now because we just absolutely whooped him and both of them seems like they're going up this one's going down a little bit because it has this little draft thing but if we replace him with a new or things would be amazing and it looks like this one is going up enough for both of them so we can power this entire base with just two or and two of the not so great pals and on top of that, I did not mention, but this thing right here is super, super important. So this actually buffs the amount of electricity they output. It is right over here in the other section, the electric pylon. This takes 30 electric organs, 100 ingots, and 20 circuit boards. So it's definitely a little expensive, but this is super necessary in the new update and this is one of the most important things they put in the entire game so you guys can see we're still barely hanging on with the new pals but with that and if i catch a few more of these ore cirques, we should be absolutely perfect and right now we are just squeaking by so we can probably make about 150 oil per hour which i think is a good amount on this new update i'm not really sure you guys will have to let me know how much uh oil are you guys doing per hour in your base i'm doing about 150 i've noticed with two of them which i think is pretty good so maybe if this guy wasn't slacking off and doing what he has to do in the pool we would do, be doing even better but for the most part this is a pretty optimal setup you guys will have to let me know your setups and i'm going to put the rest of the pals back in here so let me know if you guys knew about this new electric thing that they put in here and how to use it and everything in my opinion i had no idea and i had to look up in my discord how to actually like get this new electric thing and i was still using the old ones guys which wasn't really working now i'm going to be posting a bunch of glitches on this update and a bunch of other new things with the new items and i'm going to be grinding towards level 55 so if you guys want to see that make sure you sub up or you can check out some of my other videos where i've already posted a good amount of glitches oh and we're getting a supply drop perfect right on time right a coincidence we're going to check that out and see what is in there real fast hopefully there's a bunch of crude oil hopefully there's some dog coins and maybe even the new space pal um so yeah a bunch of crude oil some uh some new spears ultra spears i feel like every kind of thing has the same the same thing every drop has like the same drops and everything so that's not too exciting but whatever i'll have to learn how to like spawn the pace the space pal from this new uh this new drop thing i don't really know how but that's the vid boys let me know if you know anything about the new electric thing it's definitely a grind for me and i'm not gonna lie i don't like these alpha pals in the uh, in the base because they just take up so much room and they block everything 